Good morning, um, Steve from the Camouflage Store again. Um, today we're going to look at the Altberg Peacekeeper P3 uh, boot, which is this fella. It's a general duties boot that the police um, use and other different kinds of authorities. Um, it's a safety boot. Um, so we'll have a quick look at this one this morning just to uh, to show you and give you an idea. Um, the sizes in this one go from a three and a half up to a size 14, which obviously includes the half sizes. Um, they do a medium fitting and they also do wide fittings. Usually the wide fittings are, are like made to order kind of thing. Um, now, because they're a full safety boot, they're what you call um, a zero rated for VAT. So you, there's no VAT on it. So generally they're obviously a lot cheaper than, um, than the other boots. So, I mean, on occasions we've had people buy these just because they look, oh look, these are cheap, let's buy them. So hopefully this um, video will give you a bit of an idea of what they are and you know, hopefully people don't make a mistake. So they, they're a full safety boot. Some of the police um, services get them issued. I know a lot of them up in the northwest get them issued in various departments here and there if they're doing specialist roles that they require them. So Peacekeeper P3 um, they do what you call a VS which is uh, like a violent situations one where it's just a little bit different and they also do an aqua version which has the Simpatex membrane. But this is a non-membrane um, boot. Okay, so this one's a size nine. Um, it weighs just under a kilogram, about 999 grams. So just under a kilogram. Um, the height of it is about 22 and a half centimeters. Um, the, the footbed that they use is their usual air bed, um, or sorry, their air grid um, insole for this one as opposed to some of the hot weather ones that they use for the jungles and all the rest of it okay so that is that now the the sole unit they've changed um, they used to have what you call a Skywalker sole unit now they've improved it um, and it's now called the Rhino sole now this boot has been around since what the mid 90s um, so you know there's changes happening all the time so upgrades and you know trying to improve things obviously they work with you know different um agencies to to look to try and improve you know british standards and all that sort of stuff so we've got the new rhino sole unit now it's got a better shock absorbent within the heel cavity um you've got the rand around here which will give you a little bit more um resistance against abrasions and um knocks and bumps and all the rest of it um and also the sole unit, it's got a deeper tread on it. So you're going to get more wear from this. Can still be resold as usual. Um, but it, it, it's definitely, it's deeper than the Skywalker. So, you know, that is essentially the, the difference within the sole units. Now, this one's been tested to British standards, um, EN 20345. So it's got improved slip resistance, oil and acid resistance. So they do various tests. Now, um, I don't know if any, it might not be any interest or anybody, but the way in which they test them, they go away independently to a company up in Northamptonshire uh, called Satra. And, and they're like a research and development company. Um, you know, they're fairly well known within the industry. They do all kinds of testing. They run it with the British standards. So there's like a, a general um, consensus of, of, of people and they'll look at different standards to try and improve it and they will go away and test it. So this is independently tested. It's not done in house. So it's done by Satra. Um, so that is the, the reason behind that. Now the midsole, we've got a three layer midsole on this one. Um, on right in the middle, um, they've got like a flexible steel or stainless steel uh, midsole. So that'll prevent, um, you know, anything from going, uh, from penetrating through, um, which you know, obviously is a, a big help with this one. The lining is their usual Cambrel lining. 
we know everything about that to do with the comfort levels um, and obviously the water retention virtually zero which which you want um, so that is the the lining so um, we then go to the upper so we're still looking at the 2.4 mil amphibio leather upper which is obviously as much water resistant as it can be um, if you feed it and nourish it you know it will last for ages um, now here we've got hooks so it's easily to get on and off um, you know so that is essentially the Altberg Peacekeeper P3 now we'll get um, I'll get Troy just to do um, you know a quick photo of it so you can actually see it closer up um, so again have a look on our website check out this video and obviously if you have any issues or you've got anything that you need to know about then just give us a shout obviously you can get the Sim Simpatex version with the waterproof membrane now again I just mentioned about some of the standards that this has to go through um, if I have a look through the manual with all, with everything on it you can see I mean this is I don't know if you can see that but there's various kind of um, safety um, standards which which they go through um, to ensure that this boot is going to be um, adequate for the job that in which you're doing so I won't go through all of them but you know you've got SRA ratings you've got you know heat you've got other oh, there's loads of it so um, if you need to know any more information in detail please give us a shout sales at camouflage-store.com thank you for watching again please give us a thumbs up and uh, subscribe and uh, like I said if you need any other information then don't hesitate um, to email me at sales at camouflage-store.com. Thank you. Bye-bye.